Hello again, this is Lawrence Wagner, Senior Engineer for Anderson Radiant Heating. Let's talk about maintenance of your system and items that need clarification. You would be surprised how many Eichler homeowners have infrequently or never had a service technician evaluate the proper and safe operation of the radiant heating system. This neglect can lead to an unsafe and hazardous condition along with unforeseen expensive repairs that could have been avoided. Regular maintenance and inspections of the hydronic heating system is a wise choice. Whenever the heating equipment is 10 years or older, it needs to be checked yearly. Most manufacturers suggest a check of the new high efficiency condensing boilers every 6 to 12 months. Many of the Eichler heating systems are 50 years or older with the original equipment still installed. The Eichler radiant heating system is very forgiving since it will continue to operate and attempt to heat the home even though it is not doing so properly, efficiently, or safely. It is very common for the Eichler homeowner to accept the gradual deterioration of their system's performance and overlook the safe operation of the boiler because, I quote, everything seems to be operating fine, end quote. Visit our website at radiantheat.net for a checklist that will help you determine the safe operation of the radiant heating boiler, the support equipment, and startup procedures. It is highly recommended that you operate the system every two months during the non-heating season. Don't let the equipment set idle for extensive periods of time. As an immediate 19-point guideline, the following items need to be understood by the Eichler homeowner for a happy system. One. The system pressure should always be between 10 and 25 PSI even during non-operation. Check it monthly during the heating season. 2. The boiler should be quiet during operation containing no rushing water sounds, air noise, popping or banging. 3. The new high efficiency boilers are very quiet but do have a slight fan motor sound which is normal. 4. For an older boiler the flame should remain in the firebox when lighting with no excessive rollout. 5. The boiler should light smoothly without any rumble, whistle, or explosive back pressure. 6. Never attempt to manually light a pilot on any boiler equipped with an electronic ignition. 7. There should be no water, no water or air noises at the manifold locations. 8. Comfortable and even heating throughout the home should be achieved with the thermostat set between 65 and 68 degrees Fahrenheit. 9. No odors should be present around any burning border. 10. The handle on the pressure relief valve should be able to be lifted to discharge the boiler water pressure and when released the system should quickly refill to 10 to 25 psi with the pressure reducing valve. 11. All the older atmospheric boilers require a 6 inch clearance to combustibles while the new high efficiency condensing boilers have zero clearance requirements. Do not store anything that is combustible in the same location with an older boiler system. 12. Never flush the tubing system unless recommended by the service technician. 13. Never install tubing sealers in any copper tubing radiant panel. 14. Ensure the water supply valve to the boiler is always in the open position. 15. Clean all the combustion air grills, grills yearly. 16. Repair any leaking fittings around the support equipment. 17. It is common for some of the older boilers to condensate producing corrosion around the draft hood and sides of the unit. This is more cosmetic than damaging. The white buildup can be wiped down with a slightly acidic solution to remove the material. 18. Check all the flue connections are tightly sealed to prevent the introduction of carbon monoxide into the surrounding space or home. And 19. Check that the thermostat turns the system on and off. Replace the batteries yearly when so equipped. This is the only way to ensure your Eichler rating si heating system is safe and efficient to operate is to perform a yearly maintenance accomplished by a licensed and experienced contractor. This checkup is well worth the cost and can assure the longevity of the equipment. Until our next video, 
This is Lawrence Wagner, Senior Engineer for Anderson Radiant Heating.